good evening and welcome straight from ayodhya's ram ki padi the continuous coverage of the ram mandir or ram temple is ongoing and it is a very special occasion to talk about the ram mandir at this time we are joined us with esteemed spiritual guru gurudev shri shri ravi shankar ji thank you very much prachi it is a pleasure to be here my first question to you is about the culmination of so many years of penance the end of a long wait for the ram mandir what would you say about the experience of the ram mandir this is not just for india it is a significant moment for all humanity it is a celebration of life for everyone irrespective of caste or creed on this occasion all people come together to celebrate the arrival of lord ram not associated with any politics or caste the arrival of maryada purushottam ram is inspiring everyone to celebrate this festival with enthusiasm and we can see the excitement spreading across the country and the world now as a ram mandir is being built there seems to be a struggle to take credit for it when we look at the protests the movements and the long wait in your opinion who deserves credit for the construction of the ram mandir see this has been the dream of so many people for 500 years people have preserved this dream and now with the sacrifices of so many with the contributions of many this dream is coming true a prime minister and chief minister with their dedicated efforts are ensuring the rapid progress of the construction it is a wonderful opportunity for everyone to come together and participate in this grand celebration some may argue about who gets credit but the truth is it's a collective effort indeed the enthusiasm among the indian people is palpable but now as the ram mandir is being built there is a debate emerging about the consecration of the deity after establishing the shivling in rameshwaram and then constructing the temple the consecration wasn't immediate what is your take on this aspect the rules regarding building temples vary based on the presence of divine energy where there is already a divine presence like in rameshwaram the process may differ but here in ayodhya where lord ram himself resides his presence is palpable his blessings are felt now until now the temple's consecration hasn't taken place but after its completion the consecration is essential i would say it is a matter of authority to decide these matters it is interesting to understand the nuances involved in temple construction lastly guruji there are voices raising concerns about the consecration of the deity in the ram temple what is your message to them especially at this auspicious moment across the country there is a wave of devotion people are becoming rammay in the devotion to lord ram my only request would be for everyone to participate in this celebration wholeheartedly there are different opinions but now is not the time to hold back there is an opportunity for everyone to come together and be a part of this grand event thank you guruji for sharing your insights on this auspicious occasion jai gurudev